That bot swiggins is fucking doing work. Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, I am your humble narrator. Welcome back to Awesome Knots. Today we have an online multiplayer match with the mighty mighty deadlift. Deadlift. <laughs> Always strong and hard and fast and swift. Or something like that. He's got a pretty nice melee attack. I like to buff that with the uh, healing, the speed, and the damage. As always, speed and damage, extremely important for these characters. Uh, but then he's got his leap, which obviously could use some more damage, and his shield, um, which doesn't actually do any damage. So this is more of a tanky support character, but I think it's really, really interesting to uh, play him, especially if you've got some uh, tanky characters to support. At the moment, I, I don't really see any. I guess Swiggins can sort of be a tanky character, depending how he's built. Um, Especially once he gets that um, that health upgrade. I can't remember what it's called. It's not the Medican, that is uh, health regen. But I know Swiggins has access to that health upgrade, which is super, super nice. And he is doing some work. It is a bot Swiggins, and I am super surprised that he is uh, so proficient with his anchor. Anyways, uh, for the shield, I like to increase the health. Uh, decrease the shield decay and then giving it a healing burst at the end is usually a really really good idea as well um, and then the the leap obviously give it damage and then I like to increase the range decrease the cooldown pretty obvious um, setup if you ask me but it works it works for what it does which is uh, basically dishing out the damage there are some probably more uh, supportive team style builds, but right now I'm going for kills with Deadlift. I want to make a good video, <laughs> so we're going uh, superhero mode. And I am really scared. This Skoldier can definitely dish out more damage than Deadlift can, but um, that's okay. We're gonna try and get some help. There we go. Get the get him, Penny. Get him. I was gonna chase him into the Solar Boss. He kind of juked us out just there. Oh man, Penny missed as well, he juked her out as well. That is not good, but this Nips is going to eat shit. <laughs> that Swiggins is really locking him down for me, I appreciate that a lot. Thank you Bot Swiggins, you are a, a hero among men. So here comes the Skoldier again, his teammates are uh, basically dead, I almost died just then as well. <laughs> That's not good. Uh, Solar Boss doesn't have a health bubble near him, so we're not going to bother with that. I'm just going to go to base. Fuck it. Oh no, I can't go to base with the shield up. That's ridiculous. I thought that I could go to base with my shield up, um, and hopefully avoid a Rocco arrow should it come along to try and interrupt me. He didn't shoot the arrow, uh, but I also didn't end up going to base. I guess that's going to be fine. I would really like that, uh, upgrade. I'm going to chew this Rocco up. Oh well. We're both at kind of low health. I don't want to risk it. Penny, you go home too. This is not going to be good. Um, so yeah, we're going to go for healing on the golden arm punch, which I think should uh, add to my longevity significantly. Right now I've only got the, uh, the attack speed increase. Oh, there's that Rocco again. This time I got him. Really, really nice. Um, Skoldier is here three on one. Ain't going to be too good for him neither. And that's a, a kill for Penny Fox. So we're doing some things. I'm really trying to keep this top turret up. Um, yeah, both of our turrets are looking pretty shitty compared to theirs, but it be what it be sometimes. I'm going to tank this turret, get my droids up nice and close, and uh, hopefully we can get some easy damage. Swiggins, could you come and help me or go home? That's fine too. Oh, and I didn't realize that that Nibs was uh, on the run. I should have been watching the minimap a little bit closer, but that's alright. I'm not scared of Skoldir with my shield up, but uh, yeah, I'm not going to be able to do too much against him, I guess. There's a nice hit with the, uh, the lunge. I do like that a lot. And then we can just chew up this Skoldir a little bit. Uh, the thing I enjoy probably most about Deadlift is that fucking lunge. It can be used in so many ways. Uh, it's really good to initiate. It's great for just a little bit of burst damage, and then it can also be used to uh, run away, uh, especially with the range increase on it. It can also be used to like block off your enemies. If your enemies are a little bit ahead of you, you can jump your way in front of them, which hopefully I'll be able to demonstrate at some point in this match. Um, 
Deadlift is a really, really versatile character, and I don't see many people that play him, uh, playing him to his fullest extent, which I think is unfortunate. Um, obviously, you know, most people consider him to be just a, a bit of a supporter. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Wanted that scold you so bad. I was trying to bump him into the solar boss, but that didn't happen. Now that Rocco's scared of shit, because we got the Swiggy over here. Oh, please don't die, Swigs. And, uh, I got a good amount of damage on him. It might have killed with the, uh, damage increase to the leap, but we'll have to wait just a little bit longer for that to happen, because I cannot let the, uh, the defenses down here. Everything's going bad. Alright, we almost got that top turret, so hopefully their top turret will fall before our top turret, but only time will tell, as is, uh, as in most things in Ocenauts. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow. I thought that Skoldir was going down, but he did not, um, basically because he's got the healing on that punch, which is always a terrifying thing. And trying to lure him into the turret just a little bit. There he is, just going for it. Oh my god. Nice damage on the Rocco. And Penny was able to finish him. Super nice job. Oh. This is, uh, this is not good. So, we've lost our front turrets. It's quite ugly. We're gonna have super droids coming on the top and the bottom lane, which I'm not looking forward to at all. But, um, I'm gonna try and stay in here and tank the turret. Oh god, here's Skoldir. He can out-damage me. I just wasted my leap as well. So hopefully I can, uh, get away somewhat. That stun is also killing the shit out of me. I just wasted the leap again. He's got nibs with him. It's over. Damn. So their team is sticking together rather well uh, compared to our team. But basically for our team to stick completely together, we both have to be following the bot swiggins around, which doesn't seem like the greatest idea to me. Really nice kill on the on the Rocco there. He was hungry for the swiggins, and uh, that was too bad for him, wasn't it? I'm going to try and finish these droids before... Oh god. This turret has taken some massive damage already. Really fucking not good. I'm not liking that at all. But, um, I still have hope. You know, maybe our team can get it together. I'm not taking the blame for this one. And, oh, I'm gonna get the skull there. Alright. And I almost got the fucking, uh, the nibs as well. That would have been a nice double kill, but... I'm happy with 6-1. and one. That is a, a pretty good score, and the, the match is not over yet, so we're going to keep pushing pushing in, and uh, hopefully that Swiggins can lock down some more kills for me. Hi, Swiggins. Speak of the devil. And they're just jumping over the droids. Really, really nice, although I did take a slowing arrow to the face. So, um, nice job, Rocco. Rocco's not one of those characters that you see too much in high-level play basically because his auto attack is what you're mostly using. Oh, and this, this Skoldir's done. I didn't get the kill, but that's okay. As long as he's dead, I don't care. There's my kill. Oh no. <laughs> the Swiggins made a double kill. That fucking bot Swiggins is on point, dude. We're uh, chewing up the top turret now, which is rather nice. I tried to protect um, everybody with my shield, but it didn't quite work. Ooh, and the Swiggins again with the kill. Super, super nice. Um, my lunge damage was able to help out just a little bit there. Gotta run around and creep and get some health back up. Um, yeah, Deadlift has some extreme sustainability if you build, build him for that. Uh, this match I have built him more for damage than sustain, but um, he can run either set relatively well. So we're gonna get out of here before... Yep, there's the skull there. <laughs> I'm going away now. Everybody leave me alone. Okay, now I'm gonna come back. Ah, nice health. I love health bubble. Alright, so we've got um, Nibs chasing Swiggins around on the bottom. I'm gonna try and pinch him. Alright, how you doing? And obviously, um, Deadlift is a giant, giant wall. If you can... Um, time your enemy's jumps against your jumps, then you can prevent them from moving forward, which is 
a pretty advanced tactic, if I do say so myself. Uh, something that I didn't realize you could do when I first started playing Awesome Knots. They're using the uh, leap to get away from the Skoldir as my droids were able to pound on the turret just a little bit. So that is super, super nice. Uh, Penny Fox is going to need to be careful with the Skoldir down here. And I just saved her. You're so welcome. I hope, uh, I hope it wasn't for nothing. Oh god. I should have had my shield up. That's okay. It had a, a little cooldown on it left. And there, just what I was talking about earlier, cutting off the uh, enemy skull deer. Super nice. Wonderfully done. We're going to be able to chew up this turret because all they have is a Rocco, and he has uh, got his blinders on. He's going for that bottom turret for sure. So we're going to chew this open. Very nice, uh, but I'm not going to let him get that bottom turret. That is for sure. He's uh, able to get pinched off pre pretty well, and we'll see what he does. Oh, he just juked me hard. <laughs> That's okay. Shoot your arrow. All right. I didn't take any damage from the arrow, he did just break my shield, um, so that's nice. But now the droids are beating on the uh, turret again, which is never a good thing. Oh, our droids were able to stop their droids. That's a, that's a good thing, I like that a lot. Um, so let's see if we can push this bottom lane through and then we'll be in a relatively good position. This was a rather close match to start with, it uh, had me a little nervous at the beginning. But everything seems to be turning out okay. I will take this health bubble, thank you. And then let's see if I can out damage this skull deer. Oh god. Oh fuck. I don't want any part of uh, Nibs. Nibs and skull deer team. That is not good. Boom, some nice damage. I don't think it's gonna be enough. Nope, nope, nope. I'll just let Penny have that. Get away from the fucking Rocco. I've got a lot of, uh, a lot of solar stacked up. I could probably finish my my build at least somewhat. I have finished my melee attacks, but uh, the range and the health on the shield is also extremely extremely important for playing deadlift well. All right, you want to go, Skull Deer? We can go. And as you can tell, I'm chewing him up. But uh, yeah, with the help of that Nibs, I'm gonna need to get the fuck out of there. We're at a bit of a, a stalemate now, they definitely don't want us to take that last turret down, but I don't know if they're going to have much to say about that. I don't know if that's going to be an option for you. And there we go, knocking down the Skull Deer. Um, I guess once Deadlip gets his melee upgrades completely up, then he can outdamage the Skull Deer to the point where the healing is not necessarily going to work as well as it should. So. We're doing relatively well. I'm liking this a lot. I should have jumped to block the nibs if I could. But I absolutely screwed that lunge up. <laughs> Just lunged into the ground. Which is uh, not what you want to do, obviously. So, we've got the Rocco here. Mm, I probably should have tried to lunge on him. I think I might die. Oh god. I wanted to save Swiggins. Yeah, I'm done. <laughs> Guess who's back? Back again. Dayton's back. Uh, I'm gonna get the snips. I want him real bad. Oh god. That was uh, quite a brutal thing that just happened. I'm thinking I can now damage the skull deer. Oh god. Fuck. What a, what a turnaround. <laughs> god damn it. So I got a little bit of tunnel vision there and uh... Tried really hard to take down the Skull Deer, which did not work out for me. Um, gonna have to be a little more careful. At least not pop my shield so early. Um, it's one of those good twist moves that can really change the course of a, a fight as it's going. I'm trying to rescue Penny there from the fires. The fires of hell! And here, uh, Skull Deer again. I'm gonna play a little more cautious. And we had our entire team, if Penny would have waited for Swiggins to lock him down, then we could have got the KO, but that's relatively okay. And here, everybody's working on my turret. Not gonna let this happen. Not today. Get out of here! Oh my god, Penny. Penny! Penny! Ow. Oh. She did okay. Ran towards the Swiggins, and uh, 
Swiggins was able to get that kill. That bot Swiggins is fucking doing work. I don't know what happened uh, between last week and this week. The bots got fixed, I guess. Here, I'm tanking that fucking turret again. Rocco, <laughs> easy kill. That was amazing. He's, he's uh, running towards his death. Little did he know. And hello to you, Mr. Skoldier. Boom, jump over his head. Obviously, that's not gonna work out too well, but we can uh, at least get some distraction going and hopefully the droids will uh, be able to finish this game up for us. Maybe, perhaps? I think uh, me and Penny are gonna do some nice work. I just have to keep leaping in. Oh my god. No, no, no. And I got the health bubble, you fuck! Alright, it is a, a close match, but we do have the advantage, so don't let this turret go down. No! Oh god, if anybody farts on that fucking thing, it is going down for sure. So, we're gonna need to be careful. Um, yeah. School Deer's making his way down here. I don't want any droids to come with him. If we can just push into the base, then we'll be in pretty good shape. Uh, it looks like Skoldir's chasing around that penny, which is good news for me. Aw, oh, yes! Hello, Rocco! <laughs> and poor Rocco's getting chewed up by Deadlift. Anyways, that is it, friends. Thank you so much for watching. This has been Awesome Knots with Deadlift. I have been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Thank you so much for watching. Finally, PvP matches are fixed. We can get some online battles going, which is super, super exciting. I hope you guys are just as excited as I am. Sorry for the uh, big gap in Awesome Knots uploads. I was going strong for a little while and then kind of faded out, but you know, that's, that's kind of how it does sometimes. Uh, get a little bored or, you know, matchmaking takes a poop and I can't do it. <laughs> but uh, we are back. I hope to stay. Um, but I'm gonna have to brush up my skills just a little bit more, I think. Although 11 and 4 is not bad for deadlift. Anyways, friends, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy the content. We will be back with some more, and I hope you'll enjoy it some more. Anyways, I'll see you in the next one, friends, and until then, bye-bye! One, two, three, four, goodbye, 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 see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friend.